So when we go filming with CK9, we start the day by snoozing our alarm five times and then deciding to get up on the five, fifth try. <laughs> but not until we know the other one's up because we don't want to get up. <laughs> that's, that's if, if, the, if the other two are still in bed, I'm like, oh, there's no point in me getting up yet. My most important thing that I bring is my brain. <laughs> you have a brain? <laughs> Yeah, so I have a ski list that I look at every morning before I go out. And it's helmet, GoPro, goggles, face mask, jacket, beacon shovel pro, pants, gloves, knee pads, boots times two, heated socks, skis, poles, full face, food, water, skins, wallet, airpods, survival kit, knee compression, in reach, sled key, oil, gas, reading the avalanche bulletin, like looking at the weather, looking at clear dark sky, like checking five different weather stations and just kind of figure out what's going on. Three years ago, somebody put us in the same house <laughs> <laughs> with Simon and Clay from CK9 in the same Airbnb. <laughs> we just all got along really well and yeah, they ended up calling us up in the fall and saying, hey, we have an opening for filming and we want to make another ski movie, so we'd love to make a project with you guys. So just about uh, the three of us getting out in the back country together and hilarity that ensues from all of it so we're going to capture that it's like there's these like ski movie gods and you have to like pay your penance by like going out <laughs> like, all the though. time and trying really hard and like yeah crashing and, and, cr and failing crashing and failing and having gear yeah. breakdown and not getting a single shot all day yeah um, multiple days. And then they're like, oh, you have tried hard enough. We're going to give <laughs> yeah. you gonna, one day. We're going to bless you with this day. Yeah. Cause Better take advantage in, of it. You put in the time. <laughs> um, yeah. So that that's kind of how it works. After a week of like not getting it, you've been out there, you're tired, you're like so exhausted. You're like, what are we doing? But then you have one of those days where like everything lines up and you're like, this is why we do it. If you just have a couple of those days in between where like everything lines up, it makes everything worth it and you go back even though you have another 10 days of maybe not even putting your ski boots on. You have to enjoy the process or else you're just be a miserable bastard for the rest <laughs> of your life. Yeah. <laughs> if you don't enjoy the process, the process is everything. Like the outcome is so small compared to the process. Enjoying the process like can sometimes guarantee a good outcome mm -hmm. because you're, the energy you're giving to the process is always like happy and then that makes for a better outcome in the end. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah.